Hello there. I hope you're well. Now, I don't want to scare you or anything, but I'm sharing one of my dreams with you. Another one. So last night or this morning, I dreamt that I was inside my house, I guess, and I was with another female, like um, a younger person than me, but not a child, maybe a teenager. And there's this, there was this gent. I won't call him a gentleman. There was this man on the outside. Our door was open, but it was secured by a second door or a grill. And this man outside kept looking in, looking in, looking in. I think he was washing clothes or something. It's someone we would know. Because he wasn't a stranger to us, but it's maybe not someone we speak to. So, he was looking and looking in, and we could see that he had an intention. We were, we were washing or doing household chores and about to get ready to like go out or something. And it was evening time. And this man, we could see the, some intention on his face for the deed that he had in his mind, which you can guess what it is. And I was looking at him like suspect as I'm watching him like, what is this man up to? So he would come to the door. And I mean, he was determined, you know, like psychopathically determined to get in without or without how we feel, without if like without feeling threatened by us or he just didn't care. And it reminded me of the last dream I had similar to this where this Brother walked up to the window and said, he deliberately told me that that is what he came to do. He's like, that's what I came to do, you know, and he wasn't upset. He wasn't frustrated. He had a little smile on his face, like, but I could tell he's lost his mind or something, right? Now, this one in this dream, he was more eager, more determined. He was, he's older as well. He has hair that is somehow long to the sides not very long like maybe to his um to his neck his cheek no i mean like his jawbone all right and this man wanted to get in the house like he was literally trying right live and directly in front of our eyes and fortunately because the door is open right but fortunately the grill was locked Cause I was like almost beginning to panic. I was like, oh my God, I've got to lock the door. How come I left the door open? And this man, he tried to like come up and say something to us, talk to us. And it, it's just strange. And then he, he was, he tested the door or something, the grill. And then he was out there fun dangling with some stuff, like maybe trying to figure out how to get in, like right in front of our eyes. He didn't care that we see. He didn't care that we could scream for help, which we weren't doing. We were paranoid. We were like, what the frig? Now, I, with my protective instincts, kicked in. You know, I had to take action. I'm like, what the frig? This person was literally like, you know when you watch them zombie movies and you know that the zombie only rise up to get dead? Yeah. Yeah, you know that this particular zombie that is shown in this scene going on, carrying on bad, rah, rah, and then he get one bullet pew, pow, in the head. I'm sorry. That's what we're talking about movies, right? So, yeah. Um, So I feel like this is particular person. That is what they were after. Because I'm like, this is strange. I don't know if we're going to see a breakout of people trying to harass people. Feminine and females trying to break in and ish like that. Because remember the, the last dream I had, this person wanted to get through the window, but he, the person couldn't get through the window. So the person sent a female through the window and I don't know how the freak she got through. Because like they're the same size. But he was like, okay, I can't get in. So he sent a female in through the window, right? And she fell to the floor. She was like limp. Like maybe she was drugged or maybe the dream was saying she did it unwillingly. You know, she didn't want to do it, but maybe because she was a part of the gang gang 
or I don't know, maybe he brainwashed her. And so I don't know what these dreams signify. I feel like the dream I had this morning, last night, was way longer than this. But this is the part I can remember. You know, this is what I can remember about it. I think we ended up going out anyway. Is that because we, we were watching him go run around the yard and so on and so forth. But like I said, I don't think he was a stranger. But we've it's not like we have a relationship with this person. Like a, a, an intentional relationship. And we ended up going out, out locking. I don't remember exactly. I'm just saying, you know, be mindful, be careful, maybe... <sighs> I don't know what's going on because it's the energy of them when they come when or in the dreams. It's like they don't really care. That's what I'm saying. It's like some something wake up in them, some spirit. They don't care that you're going to call the police. They don't care that you could shoot them or throw hot water on them. They don't care that you could scream for help. They don't care that you, like they don't have, I don't know. It's strange. This is a strange thing. It's just, it's like it's like I said, zombie. But these people are easy to can I land land? You know what I mean? They're easy to annihilate. It's like what I'm saying. It's like one of them zombies will just rise up, forget, forget, put down. It's that the big old tough zombie where I forgot to fight with for one length of period of time. This is the one that rise up instant. So these people, can, they can get taken up. But then I'm wondering, like you can protect yourself against them. But then I'm wondering why, why it happened. It's like, I'm, you know, like when a zombie is just doing something against its will, but still it wants to do it, think it, it, it believes it's going to enjoy it. It's like something take over, something take over, possess. These people, like, all of a sudden, you know that movie, The Happening, with him, one of them brother, the, the Born Identity, I think. One of the guys that, what's his name, that came come in the Born movie? Um, so the movie, The Happening, where this wind rose up, and if the wind blows past you, you're going to have the urge to take yourself out in horrendous ways. That is the energy that these people, I, I felt it. This person in my dream felt like that. Like he, This person was just outside washing. We were cleaning. And then all of a sudden, it's like they, they wanted to come and just take, you know, that R word, take advantage. And it's like they decided. It's, it's like a sickness. I don't know. 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 And they don't care about their life. They don't care. I don't think they're thinking life. Like I'm telling you, it's like something has taken them over. Like what the frig? Anyway, we will see. Much love. Take it easy out there. Much love, guidance, and protection. And don't like, don't be afraid. Because you're the hero of your story. But I guess I just wanted to st share that message with you still. About that situation. Because I'm, I'm saying it's like these people could be anybody. They could be close to you. Like you wouldn't even expect. Like it's crazy. You wouldn't even expect these people to all of a sudden be talking about. Maybe they want to have sex with you. Or it's the R word. But I don't know what they're looking for. It's like, I don't know if someone told them that, yo, yo, if you, I don't know if there's some undercover secret going around where if you do something with the females, you'll be safe. So all of them are out to get one. It's, it's gnarly. It's gnarly. I don't know, man. Some lies been told. Oh, I probably should have been shuffling while talking about that. Uh-uh. <sighs> And I pray to God I'm not a channel of bad news. <laughs> you know, but still, something seems to be happening that we're not seeing. 
it's like when the full moon come up and just a spirit i don't know man all right i love you take it easy out there